Hey, it's Erica. We're gonna be checking out Misa Mo's new look. I am so excited because their debut as a subunit was so good. I mean, do not touch Marshmallow, Funny Bell Time, everything. All the B-sides were dope. The album was fantastic. Um, their performances were fantastic. Um, the music videos were fantastic. And this one, it's uh, Haute Couture, right? And then the trailer was Atelier. Um, so we are we are high fashion. We are serving the C-U-N-T. Um, and this one is called New Look. This is not, this is a uh, pre-comeback technically, right? Um, so this is uh, just a track on it. It's not the title track, but I'm very excited because we're diving into it. We're getting a little bit of a taste of what Misamo is doing. Um, and I love what they served us last time. It literally gave me life. So it's really nice to get like life within me again. Um, take me out of the post-concert depression, me some please. Um, no, cause damn it, no, cause I'm thinking about all the times I saw twice like oh never mind. Um, but anyways, really excited. New look, no idea what to expect, but you know what it let go. 16 years ago in studio, they haven't been around for 16 years. All right, first AD, what's up? Okay, new look. In the suits? Just like Twiggy? Yes, Misa, Momo. Ooh. New looks. Oh, the peasant. Oh, the peasant. Oh, the peasant. Oh, the peasant. Oh, what song does Sana say that in? <gasps> yes. It's so cute! Oh, Liv, hello! It's cute. Ooh. Break it down, Ms. Momo! Girls' interests are always in fashion. I mean, yes. Yes, what's in what's out? The plan is for an OMG. Oh my gosh. No one has said her suit looks like the Twice members have. It is a new look though, and it's serving. Oh, it is such a cool production of a video too. Like, look at all this stuff. Like, it's giving golden era of Hollywood, you know? Okay, choreography. <gasps> oh. A little cute little plot bomb, yes. Okay, double lips, Lana. Okay, cut. Cut. Just like Twiggy in cinema. I don't know, was Twiggy ever in any movies? Oh, we're still going. I mean, Court, if you eat it down, my queens. Pose. Yes, Powerpuff Girls. Double cut. They kept rolling and they didn't cook it the second time, girl. I have been there so many times on set. 
That was so cute! I love that. That was like so good. It kind of has like an old Hollywood, like golden era, age of like Hollywood type of like vibe too, which was just like so cute. And I think it really works for like how they craft Misa all as like a concept. Like the other one, they were, they were art, they were artworks. You know what I mean? So those looks there were very like, um, like that sort of inspiration from like the art world and stuff and you look at fashion as a form of art and that's what we definitely get here and the outfits here were definitely serving that so I really like it it's really cool it's technically not the first time we've kind of seen twice do it because I mean we can look at many different twice concepts in a video you can look at like the black and white scene from Nyan's Na you can look at the black and white scene from oh who did it in uh no it was it was cheer up and stuff Someone had a black and white scene. You know what I mean? So like the visual concept, it's not like so unfamiliar, but it's like really cool to just kind of see them like lean fully into it. And it kind of being like, they're on a sound stage or outside of the sound stage, you know what I mean? It was really, really cool and doing all these different things. And then it's just like a modern time, but it's also the past and it was like so cute. And it's like a little bit of like a cuter, brighter sound, which is really dope. Um, but I mean, the way Twice hits, as a girl, it just like, I'm like, they get it. Yes, fashion, those new shoes, I want them. <laughs> Am I going to get them? No, but I'm gonna I'm stare at it enough to where I feel satisfied of them, you know what I mean? Um, so I'm like, okay, they get it. Like, girls' interest in fashion, I'm like, yes, queens, we, yes, we know. And the fashion with the whole couture and the atelier concept were really cool and really dope, and again, no one has served suit looks, like twice as served suit looks. I mean, ever since they did it for the Eyes Wide Open album, like it was just so iconic and so good. And it's just like, maybe sprinkles here or there, you know, the members in them or whatever, but kind of like seeing them here once again. And it's just like the cut, the silhouettes of the outfits. I'm like, ooh, yes, Miss Mans, it is a new look. Um, and we love it. And I kind of like love the lyrics of it as well when the chorus and it goes just like, um, I don't I, I don't know if like Twiggy was in a movie. Cause she was like, when is she like very popular and like, um, let me, let's look it up. Let's look it up. I don't even, like, she may have been. A lot of models act and stuff are in, um, uh, movies and stuff, you know? Um, but yeah, so it would have been, like, she was very popular in the 60s, you know? Um, so let me look. Oh, she was in movies. Okay, what was she in? The Blues Brothers, The Boyfriend Club Paradise. I, okay, yeah, I don't... Yeah, all right, that she was in movies, you know what I mean? Um, in a lot of them, Jesus, okay, okay, Google, all right. Um, so yeah, she was like an actress and stuff, so like, um, kind of just like getting that. I just know her from America's Next Top Model, you know what I mean? And she's iconic in like fashion and as a model, um, so it was really dope and kind of just like, like Twiggy in the cinema. And so then Momo kind of like, it has, she has like a 60s look, but not like directly like a Twiggy look, but that kind of like thing was cool and just like wearing a mini skirt and how like, Oh my god, back in the day, mini skirt was so controversial. Um, you know what I mean? And kind of like that, or just like I could cut my hair short and be like a tomboy. I'm like, yes, because we serve both over here. If you look at how I look every day in the videos, it's always just like different. But that's what I feel like is so cool about like fashion and styling and hair and makeup and all that other stuff is that like one day if I want to look preppy, I can look preppy. But if the other day I want to look like an emo kid, I can look like an emo kid or alternative or um cottage core you know what I mean like the different aesthetics we like I feel like people can always just like brand themselves as one sort of thing but I think it's really cool to play and have fun and experiment and mix and match sort of stuff and especially within like high fashion it's what's interesting like I remember I saw a TikTok before discussing about like how Vivian Westwood is very kind of like punk you know what I mean um but when you put that on like um a, like a punkish or like kind of like seen in that sort of alternative culture sort of like actress or singer and stuff how it kind of, like there, there's a little bit of like a fall flat but if you put those same kind of like um uh people that kind of do like punk and alternative just in terms of just like their brand and who they are whether it's like actors again or singers and you put them in like chanel how like interesting it becomes you know what i mean so like i think stuff like that is just like so cool and i'm just like me some against it they get it they get they get they they are such like a girls girl group and i'm like this song is made for the girls it really is because i'm just like yes about like with the fashion and kind of like the old hollywood and even like old hollywood sound seekers and musicals like that inspired concept was really cool also when they did the one Michael Jackson song, that was kind of like, well, no, that was kind of, they had more of like a 70s vibe for it, right? And that was for a Japanese release. Anyways, but I'm really loving what they're serving here. This sort of old Hollywood look to it is just like very, very cool. But just like the whole couture of it, it's serving 50s and serving 60s, you know what I mean? And they were serving the outfits and then it's also, you know, the new look. It is definitely like, 
it is a little bit of like a different styling for them because I feel like with certain artists when they just have like the look and the silhouette it kind of can be like consistent throughout many comebacks for like an idol group um I kind of seen a little bit of something different style wise was really cute I really love it their hair was cute everything about them was awesome and adorable um and the styling was great and the choreography was great and looks like I mean we saw lines we saw angles they were killing they were eating it down but yeah I mean I really liked it it's all about the it, like the sort of combination of fashion of, of like fashion like high fashion and like old Hollywood was just like really cool and overall yeah I think the concept was amazing visually it really worked for me the choreography looked great and dope they had so many dancers Sonic I liked it twice I'm like girl fly um but yeah so hopefully we do get a better look at this choreography because it looks very interesting and I would love to get it um um, hopefully fingers crossed knocking on wood that we get the choreography um but yes no the song and it's also just like such a cute bright sort of song you know what i mean which i would say on the, lo the last album it wasn't like the kind of like a, it wasn't like uh, like a super poppy sort of vibe versus just like this one a little bit softer sweeter poppy song you know what i mean for the girlies um it definitely makes sense and i mean like twice and stuff has always had like there's always tracks for the girlies on the albums you know what i mean so it just sort of me some old sort of diving into that um as well it feels very twice but also feels very me some old, and i have loved every single second of it um because we love me some old, and it was so cute and so good i loved it go to put your thoughts and comments down below to them about me some old's new look if you like this video give this video a thumbs up if you liked me and you want to see more of my videos go and hit that subscribe button if you want to see my videos the second they come out hit that notification button if you want to follow me on social media twitter is on tiktok threads or description down below or at the end screen if you like gaming content i have a gaming channel it's called erica currently playing silent hill 2 remake and resident evil remaster for spooky season so hope you could join me over there for that thank you so so much for watching love you and i'll talk to you later bye oh.